Okay, so we're given the fact that the nth term is 7n plus 25, but here we're asked to find out what uh, position um, 60 is in our sequence. Now, there's loads of different ways you could do this. You could just write out the sequence and keep going until you get to 60. A quicker way is just equal the uh, nth term to the number that you're asked to find and then solve it. So I'm going to take away 25 from both sides. So we're left with 7n equals, take away 20 would be 40, take away another 5 would be 55. Uh, take away, not 55, sorry, be 35. And then we're going to divide 7 both sides. So n equals 5. Now it's a good way of checking to see if a number is in a sequence because if you work out that n is a decimal then that number is not in the sequence. So it isn't a decimal, it's an integer so we know 60 is the fifth term in the sequence.